Hi, Naila. Hi. I made a lot of mandazi. Yeah. You like mandazis? Yeah. How many you want? Um, just one. Just one? Yeah. And that's it? Yeah. Are you sure you want just one? Look how, how yummy. I made a lot of mandazi. Mandazi, 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 mandazi. I'm not very good at making mandazi, but I made mandazi. So, uh, mm -hmm. listen. Uh, sorry, what did you say? I made the mandazi. Yeah. You like mandazi? Yeah. Don't touch it. So anyway, do you want to eat some? Yeah. I okay. can take only one. Okay, just uh, don't, 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 don't touch. So this is what we're going to do, okay? okay? I'll leave you with this mandazi. Mommy, mm? I could be happy with you. I'm going to be happy with you. I will give you one part and you'll be happy with me. Yeah, so I'll give you I'll leave this mandazi here. Okay? okay. Don't touch it. Don't eat it yet. Okay. When I come back, don't do that. When I come back, listen. When I come back, I'll give it to you. I'll go in my room and then I'll be right back. Okay. So you watch this mandazi, okay? Okay. Yeah? Are you sure you're not gonna touch it? You want me to keep it here? Yeah. So you just watch it, okay? okay? You watch it, you watch it, and then mommy will go, I'll go in my room. Okay. And then I'll be like five minutes, then come back. Okay, mommy. Do you have money for the mandazi? Yeah. How much you have? I have five. Five what? Five dollars. Five dollars? Okay, yeah. you uh, make sure this mandazi is safe. Don't? Don't eat it yet, okay? okay? Are you sure you're not gonna eat? No. I'm going in my room. Okay. I'm going in my room. Okay. Okay, don't eat my mandazi yet. Okay. What did you do? You did you eat any? No. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay. 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 Just sit like a good girl and watch my mandazi. Okay. Okay. And I will not touch it either. Don't touch it. Okay. Don't touch it. Okay. 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 I, touch. I touch the table. Yeah, you can touch the table. Don't touch mandazi. Okay. 
Okay, now, good job. What? <laughs> Let's eat my nasi. I'll give my nasi because you have been a good girl. Did you touch it? No. You didn't touch any? No. Okay, good job. Is there? No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Ah, ah, ah. Stop it. That's one is good for you. And Dada is going to bed. Dada is going to eat some tomorrow. Dada, Dada already had some. Is it yummy? Cut for me. Cut some for me. Are your hands clean? Yeah. Can I trust your hands? Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to see if she can watch this man. Dada. Did you did she touch them? No. She didn't touch them? No. Oh, she's good. I'm gonna keep the mandazi. We're not eating because it's they are still they are still like hot. So we'll eat some more tomorrow. Then I ate some, but we're gonna eat tomorrow. More in the morning. You need to go bathroom. Okay. Eat your mandazi or fix your hair. Okay, now um, this is the deal. This is the deal. Dad, this is so yummy. That's so yummy. You like it? Mm hmm. Hmm. That's the last one. Don't eat more. Okay. If you know how to make mandazi, please help. Because I honestly don't know how to make some. You see, inside, <laughs> this nyama. Hmm. I don't know how to make good mandazis. Let me oh, don't eat that one. When you're done with that one, you go brush your teeth. Darren is going to bed. Mommy, I got some more meat. Eat and you go to bed. So now, enough of mandazi. I went to my friend's house yesterday and she gave me these oranges. <laughs> you need plenty of oranges. Even in diaspora, people are very generous. Uh, when you go to somebody's house and they have things from the farm, I like that orange. They give you these are the sweet grapefruit. Do you like grapefruit? I love the sweet grapefruit in the morning. Tiga, go go bathroom and then I can brush your teeth. Okay. Yeah. I'll fix my hair. I'll fix your hair. So I love the, the sweet grapefruit. This sweet this this is sweet, but you're not gonna and these oranges are so so sweet. She got them from the from her tree, from her orange tree. Go use the bathroom. And then you wait for mommy, okay? When you're done, you call me. Okay, Naila? This is a this is a what do you call it a raw video <laughs> day day in our lives how we live here unfiltered so these oranges are so sweet so sweet you know what what amazes me in Arizona during the winter you know like a lot of people we get a lot of oranges like a lot of oranges like some neighborhoods you just drive by and you see lots and lots of orange trees lots of them in fact some people they have like orange tree their uh, their backyards and they don't even eat those oranges i haven't seen other fruits like apples but i'm sure people do have apples but i've seen a lot of lemon and oranges they do well here in arizona so i can't wait for my my lemon tree to grow but I want to plant, um, the other day I went to Costco and I saw some orange trees, so I need to plant, to plant one orange tree, but the problem is, um, with the plants I have at the backyard, uh, they have like a drip irrigation, you know, like those little drips, so, uh, if I plant one, I'm gonna have to be watering it all the time. Which is okay so i have to dig now the problem is digging the hole i know the ground is really hard and digging the hole can be a little can be a whole problem right there 
So I need to uh, dig the hole one of these days and then uh, plant the orange tree. So imagine all these fruits and we got this from my friend. She has them at her backyard. Plenty, plenty, plenty. You just go there and you just not all oh, you want. You just get Did you get any? No. You need help? okay <laughs> i sent her to get me some water so this uh i need to put these oranges in a, like a little bowl instead of keeping them in the bag so let me get a bowl for these oranges this is spending uh, the evening with betty 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 spend the evening with me <laughs> Oh my gosh. Nyla, you need help? I got it. Good job. Okay, bring me that water. I drink it. You need to go brush your teeth. I'll come and help you. I know you can. This girl, if she go to brush her teeth, she'll be wasting all the toothpaste. Thank you, honey. So, I'll come and brush your teeth and then I'll fix your hair. Okay. Huh? I'm going to make sure I do it. No, 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 no. Bring me the toothpaste here and I help put, put some on your brush, okay? You bring me the brush and the toothpaste, okay? Okay? Yeah. Yeah, bring it here and I'll help you. So, guys. <laughs> I just do it. Okay. Let me do it and then you can brush yourself. Give me, give him, give me the toothpaste. Naila? No, no, no. Okay, I'll help you. Let me help you. No, I'll help. Come here. Naila, bring it here. I'm serious. Okay, come this way. You listen to mommy, okay? When mommy says something, just listen. Give me, give it to me. Okay, and then you give me the toothpaste and then tell guys you're going to brush your teeth. You can tell guys. Hi guys, I can put my teeth and do it, but my mommy will do it this <laughs> You can do it yourself? Yeah. Okay, then let's put some toothpaste. A little bit because you're a baby. Yeah. Okay. Sure guys, you can brush your teeth. yourself you wanna go in the sink and finish up let me help you show me don't swallow go spit out in the sink spit in the sink I'll be right there I'll be, I, I teach her to do stuff right there when they go to daycare they teach them they, te they tr teach them to be independent as much as they can so even uh, when it comes to brushing her teeth, I like her to do it. I help her because I don't want them to like all yellow. But and that reminds me, I need to book. I need to book both of them, uh, her and Darren, appointment for the dentist. They have to go to the dentist every six months. That's America for you, me. Ever since I was born, I'm never going to. I think the first time I went to the dentist is when I was. Um, after get after having Darren, because I had an issue with my own with my tooth and I lost it, and I haven't had I haven't had a, a replacement. I need to get like an implant or something. So that's the first time I went to the dentist. You all this teeth cleaning after every six months, America. You guys, if you maybe if you are in Africa, you do it every six months. I don't know, but here. Uh, I think it's kind of a requirement, you know, because sometimes they, even the insurance will remind you every six months you have to take your children uh, to the dentist so that they can have their teeth cleaned. Even as an adult, every six months you're supposed to have your, you go to the dentist and they can clean your teeth. For me, I don't have a dental insurance. So sometimes what I do is um, I go to like... Mm, the cheap the cheaper places and they have them clean for me the teeth um yeah i get them cleaned for like a fee i have to pay cash um but there's um 
there is a dentist school here in Mesa. What is it called? A T Steel. Uh, if you're in Arizona, if you don't have insurance, you can go to a T Steel and they'll do it cheaper there to clean your teeth. All. So one of these days, I'm gonna go to that. It's a it's a dental like university or dental school, so they can practice on you and pay cheaper. Uh, yeah, and it's yeah they don't it's good anyway enough of the tea that let's go back to the oranges <laughs> my my point was in this country uh these american people some of them they believe that you can eat fruits from the tree like get them from the tree and just eat them they feel like uh they have to buy fruits from the from the supermarket from the stores for them to eat it because they have they have this mentality of the trees that are just the backyard or from the trees. Some of them, they feel like, oh, they don't, they are not sprayed properly. They are not, come on. So that's why you see a lot of oranges getting wasted, going to waste just because, you know. And by the way, for the trees, for the oranges, orange trees that are on the streets, uh, I don't think they have a problem with anybody just going to grab some because, they don't really, as long as you're not going to somebody's property and start getting your fruits, as, um, you can, you know, some places they'll be happy if you get them because they will be like, hey, you get it. I know uh, some people here who have chickens and who who have chickens at the backyard and they have their own organic eggs, which are, they taste way different from the eggs we buy from the store. So even these oranges, they are so yummy than the oranges you buy from the store. So yeah, I mean, if you ever come to Arizona and you want to live somewhere, you can plant your, your fruits, somewhere you can plant any, whatever you want, just make sure you get somewhere, uh, you know, one of these homes that have like a backyard where you can plant all those things you feel like planting and yeah it works you know some people they have a lot of their backyard yeah and some people they get like an acre or i remember uh, another friend of mine they moved to uh kansas is it kansas uh, missouri and they got like a 19 acre piece of land they are kenyans so they bought a house and the 19 acre piece of, I don't know what they do with it, but I know like in, in Missouri people, I believe people do a lot of uh, farming and they have cows. So for us here, I see some people, uh, especially a lot of Hispanic people, they like to do that. They like to buy their homes somewhere and just with no HOA rules and just do whatever they want at their Although, it, you know, like do whatever they want to do with their property. But mostly um, some of those properties where they can even keep cow, cows and sheep, like a ranch, yeah? Like a ranch kind of. So for me, I don't really want to live somewhere and make my home like a ranch because i don't want to be responsible like i don't want to have a lot of responsibilities with the animals i feel like animals is a, a, a lot of work especially if they are not if i'm doing any kind of farming it has to be farming that is bringing me money if it's not bringing me money then why am i doing it you know like um some people have uh goats like pets uh here in America, most people, they don't know that you are eat, you can eat goat meat. They believe that when you eat goat, it's a pet. I mean, they believe goats are pets, so you can eat goats. And I remember one lady, she said, mm, oh, you know, um, but, uh, he, you, she was using he, 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 and I was like, who is he? And then it was a goat. She was telling me about the goat. And then I said, oh, you know, if you you want to sell it, sell it to me, I'll barbecue. And she said, no. She said, what? You want to, to barbecue, the like slaughter the goat and barbecue? And she was like, no, I'm not selling the goat to you so that you can go and kill it. She couldn't believe that we eat goat. Some Americans don't believe that we eat, that people eat goat. Oh my God. Anyway, goat is good. Um, goat meat. <laughs> and by the way, here people have a different kind of pets. Some people have like frogs. Um, people have snakes, pets. They keep them in the house. 
people have uh, all sort of creatures, you know, lizards and uh, all those scary, scary animals. You know, some of these scary um, things, they are like, um, they, they carry them for like therapy, you know, sometimes for me as a Uber driver, sometimes I carry people who have like a service animal and maybe it's a lizard or a snake, I don't know. I've never seen snake, but some some creatures, you know, and they say, oh, this is my pet. So here, don't be surprised when you come and people are keeping pets all sort of, let me know where you live, what kind of animals people keep as pets, because here people keep snakes as pets, tortoise as, as pets, um all sorts all sorts of like whatever people have a lot of weird and some people keep like really big snakes like huge as pets yeah uh so people have a lot of in dubai i see them on tiktok people keep lions and tigers and all those fancy animals as pets so I don't know. Let me go and check on Kamamu because I know she's making a mess. So thank you for spending the evening with me. Now I'm trying to do this raw, uh, raw, raw, raw videos like unfiltered and cut. <laughs> I mean, just throwing a video out there, uh, whatever. I mean, doing a video anytime I have some few minutes because I'm, I'm thinking, you know, if I if I sit down and say, oh, now I'm going to do a video, it doesn't happen. So. When it happens, it happens, but when it doesn't happen, like now, I just made the mandazi and I thought, let me do the video. And then I remember these oranges because I had to put them in a bowl and I was like, let me do a video. So anyway, thank you for spending the evening. Kids, Darren is asleep. Nyla is getting ready for bed. I better go because she's going to make a lot of mess in there. And take care, guys. The lighting is kind of crazy. Are you done, mommy? Yeah. You're still brushing? Oh, good. Clean girl. Say bye to guys. Come and say bye to guys. Okay. Close them out. Say bye to guys. Bye, guys. Speak louder. Bye, guys. Are you done brushing? Show them your teeth. They are all white. <laughs> Are you done brushing?